So today I'm going to show you how to make a material texture for your objects. So what we're going to do first is create a polygonal plane and then you're going to want to scale that up using R on your keyboard. And if the grid gets in the way, you can actually toggle on and off the grid. So that's what we're going to do over here with this icon. And you can see that it's right now just a plain gray. So to change that, we're going to go to Windows, Rendering Editors, and Hypershade. Hypershade automatically saves your work, but what you're going to want to do first is make sure that you see all the materials here. These are all named after scientists who actually created the materials outlook. So over here at Lambert is what we're going to do first. And you can see if I click on it, it's actually made a duplicate of the first one. You're going to want to make sure you do that because otherwise you change the material presets entirely. Now we're going to do wood flooring for this. And to get the texture, if you want it to be simple, you could do clicking on the color wheel over here and changing the color manually, doing the transparency, and as you can see, that changes how it looks. The ambient color, which changes the brightness, incandescence, and so on and so forth. What we're looking to do, you need to click over here on this checkerboard icon. Click onto File for your inserting a JPEG, PDF, or PNG file. And then go to this file icon and go directly to your JPEG that you want to input as a material texture. Now once you do this, you can actually edit the way it looks over here. Under exposure, you can make it brighter, you can change the default color, offset, and that color gain which basically is the saturation. Now that you've made your wood flooring, you can actually exit out. It's already been automatically saved. Select your object, right click, and <clears throat> go to assign existing materials, and go to wood flooring. And right there you can see that you have the material texture. That's all for today.